There are several ways to build solid walls using just mud or clay, but the most extensively used method has been the forming. Or we don't need the word the, uh, it could be forming, has been forming. So one method was using mud or clay. Another method is, has, is forming the mud into clay and bricks and after blah blah blah, blah to lay them. Or so to lay them is inconsistent with forming. So what about C? The most extensively used method has been having bricks. That's that's kind of awkward. Has been to form. Okay, that's good. So one method is to form the mud or clay into bricks and after blah 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 to lay them. Or right, to lay them is consistent with to form. So that's good. D looks like it might be the answer. The most extensive method has been that bricks were formed. All right, this is this is um not the right phrasing in the beginning. So D is the final answer. So in terms of concepts, we have one method that's presented, but then we're saying, well, the most extensive method has been this other method. And first you use ing. The first method was using this. So it makes sense that forming something else is another way of saying it. So we know the word the should not be there, so that's why we considered B. But the issue with B is forming, we have the keyword and. On the left we have forming, uh, here's and, we have forming, but then on the right we have to lay. So they are not consistent, and then we go to B, we go to C. C starts with having bricks, so we don't even bother reading this part. And then with D, to form, yes, that's good. Keyword and, and then to lay. So to form is consistent with to lay. So that's good. That's probably what we want, D. If you want to be sure, you can look at E. But E starts off already wrong, that bricks were formed. So this beginning part is already wrong. So that's why we choose D as the final answer. As a recap, we have you know this sentence you know, suggesting one method, but then this other method. And inside that underlined answer choice is a keyword and. So we just have to make sure what's on the left and the right are consistent. This after some preliminary blah blah blah, this is just fluff. What we have to pay attention to are the verbs, which is forming this and um, forming this and to lay, which is inconsistent. And then to form and to lay. So that's good. That's why D is correct.